So as I mentioned to you earlier, we already have urban care already operational within the area. Uh, we thought actually it was one of those uh, businesses that we actually wanted to support because we also, as we continue on with construction, we also do need and people living within the area. We wanted to have a healthcare facilities that we can actually trust and are actually more and more efficient. Yeah. So maybe we just have a look and see if the doctor's around. Do you mind if we just brief us just a bit about what you're doing with urban care with regards to the development? Uh, yeah, sure. So we are the first healthcare facility in Boomba Town. We have started like a small private practice, but um, since beginning this year we have uh, increased our services a little bit. Yes. Maybe I can show you around. Perfect. Yeah. So we have our consultation room. We are two doctors at the moment. Uh, seeing patients of all ages, from small children, baby regimens, and uh, vaccinations up to old men. Um, from here, Kumba, from the surrounding communities, Kimani, Nyamati, and from all over the Zika okay. Then we have some inpatient facilities. Would love to case, see them if you don't mind. <laughs> yes, sure. In case someone needs to have some more treatment, needs to stay overnight, needs to be observed. These are inpatient rooms. Equipped with oxygen, with all necessary medication that we would need, and then we we also have another what we call it the intermediate care room, which means if someone needs a little bit more attention, and so if someone needs to be monitored more, uh, if someone has, needs to have an ultrasound done for some minor surgical procedures like suturing, abscess drainage, all of that is being done in here. That's amazing. Yes. Sounds like you're quite prepared. Yeah. <laughs> we do what we can. Um, and then we also have um, we have two other paramedical uh, uh, sites, if you want to call it like that. That's first massage therapy yes. and psychotherapeutic counseling. Because we think a lot of people um, are suffering over the burden of overwork, stress and everything. So. It's quite well received uh, having someone like that here who you can talk to, who's objective to your problems, and that's all being done in this room. So they switch. Right now it's set up for counseling sessions, and then we also have a removable massage and acupuncture uh, set. Maybe. Must mean you're quite eager to move into the new facilities that we're going to be providing. We are, we are, because you see the space is becoming quite small. We have a small lab also in there, a small laboratory facility, and we um, we are all full pipe. We we have other um, medical uh, specialists coming or asking, wanting to come. So we need to have a bigger space. We need to move. <laughs> uh, that's amazing to hear. I'll get out of here here. So allow us to just let you continue on with your work. Thank you so much. It was nice seeing time. you. Thank you. Bye. As you have, yeah. That is what the facilities, just a taste of some of the facilities that are actually coming into the area. We have a bit more also coming into the area as well. We want to be able, in the commercial areas, to provide um, as much basic needs and facilities for the first residents moving into the area. Well, we've now reached the end of our tour. I want to thank you for joining us on this journey. And I look forward to having you as a neighbor within Fumba Town. <laughs>